My friend Angela Cartwright and I were sitting in her office one day looking over um, all of this memorabilia that we have, talking about the home movies that we had filmed when we were in Austria filming this movie, and we thought, you know, this would be kind of something that would be fun to put together in terms of a, a, a scrapbook so that some of our fans could enjoy all the, the bins of memorabilia that we had. We realized we've sort of been asked the same hundred questions for 47 years by people who love the film, and we thought, well, maybe just once and for all we should answer the those questions. This is actually my original script of The Sound of Music by Ernest Lehman with my notes in it of my first scene of having to introduce myself as Friedrich. And, you know, people can see and actually hold and touch, you know, facsimiles of the original Sound of Music script. Wardrobe sketches. That's right. Um, sketches. The telegram from my agent telling me I had the audition for the screen test. It's just all the little bits and pieces that were the instigators that led to us being yeah. chosen as the seven out of the 4,000 who auditioned. The first day we ever filmed, the first shot we ever filmed, uh, the, the thunderstorm scene of My Favorite Things. And that was our first day that we were on a set, in our costumes, working with Julie Andrews, with film going through the camera. This is the day that we shot the opening of Do Re Mi, when we're on the top of the mountain, that's why we're in our curtain clothes. And as you can see from the sky, it probably is just about to rain or just did rain. So we're just fooling around because we had hours and hours and hours of waiting. This is us filming Do Re Mi at the opening on this beautiful mountain. And you see the book also opens up, it's got these facsimiles, uh, a note from Julie Andrews to one of us. This is what's in there. And then these are the things that are in here. Heather's notebook, you know, a picture that Bill and Cora Baird uh, drew for me, uh, and they knew I spoke French, so they wrote the note in French. I wrote letters back to my dad, who was there, because I missed him so much. And they reproduced it on the Winkler. That was our hotel that we stayed at initially before you made us get thrown out, right? <laughs> our Pan Am airline ticket yeah, we to so Austria. It was very exciting. Very exciting, it was to, very exciting to fly first class from Have, yeah. Hollywood to Austria. Having never been on a plane before. Right. It was very exciting. <laughs> and, and this yeah. is the original premiere ticket. Which as yeah. you see was $100 a ticket and in 1965. That was a lot of money. That would be like what? $1,000 yeah. a ticket yeah, now. that's a lot of money. These pictures of us, and these are kind of emblematic of the moment our life changed. Because the moment this film opened, after the premiere, our lives were never the same again. And they aren't to this day. It was during intermission that the, our lives changed. That's because right. Because nobody knew yeah. when they were coming to the premiere who what, we were. what the movie was about or what it was or how good it was. These pictures that are taken during the filming of the movie, we were seven unknown kids. These pictures that were taken from the premiere on, we became the seven most famous children in the world. Here we are with the real Von Trapp family. Uh, and the two families have sort of blended now. The film Von Trapps and, and the, the faux Von Trapps. And yes. the real Von Trapps. They actually call us the non Trapps. These are collector's items that no one else has anymore. Yeah. Thank heavens our mothers kept them. Yeah.